And then, again, this uh, time I've been called to serve in, go in the government with a clear mandate to uh, uh, help uh, draw uh, uh, policies that would increase productivity and get Chile to become a developed country during this decade. That's the mission the pr President Piñera has, has uh, set for us. Mm -hmm. So uh, uh, this is very challenging. You may, being, we are different generations, of course, and we, we, some of you may think some, as, as a bit uh, distant, this idea of, of, or this love for po public policies. Uh, you are more private, a, a oriented people. In my generations, we used to think that uh, in order to change the world, you had to, to, to make a revolution. Some people around here were basically uh, wearing flowers in their heads and, 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 and trying to uh, make the re revolution through peace and, and, and love. Others around the world were doing less uh, peaceful things you know, to, 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 to change the world. Uh, and all those experiments failed, actually. But we get very moved for, uh, as a generation for finding ways of, through public policy, changing the, the, the world. And I have had the fortune of doing that, in a sense, in Chile, uh, of participating in this uh, 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 creation of a, a new way of, of managing Chile. It's sort of a startup uh, for the nation, uh, uh, which has the, uh, uh, the, the orientation of actually uh, widening the room for uh, people to innovate. So to, instead of changing the world through revolution, to change the world through innovation, which is what you see here in, in, in Silicon Valley very easily. Hmm? 